a mind faster than a calculator? A genius who can add a column of ten figures in his head almost instantly? Someone who reads transistors? 858. It would seem that way. But with a little practice, you can do the same because it figures. Here's how it works. Ask a friend to pick any two numbers between 1 and 10 and start an addition column. Then tell them to add those two numbers together to get a third number. Have them continue adding the last two numbers in the column to get the next number. As the numbers get bigger, they can use the calculator. Continue this until they have 10 numbers in the column. Starting with 3 and 5, the column would look like this. Now hand them the calculator and ask them to add the column of 10 numbers, but not to push the equal sign. Have them do this so you cannot see the display on the calculator. Next, place the calculator against your forehead and tell them to push the equal sign. Just before they do, give them the answer. 605. Amazing, but now we'll show you how it figures. As they are making up the column of figures by adding the last two numbers to get the next one, remember the seventh number. In this column, you can see it was 55. That's the only number you need. Now in your head, multiply that number by 11. Don't worry, the seventh number will never be more than two digits, even if they start with 10 and 10. And in case you didn't know, multiplying by 11 is simply a matter of addition. Watch. It may take a little practice to get that addition down, but not much since it always works the same. For instance, for 72 times 11, think 72 plus 72. 2, 9, 7. Answer, 792. Okay, once again, here's how it works. Have your friend start with any two numbers between 1 and 10 and start an addition column. Then have them add those two together to get a third number. Then the last two to get a fourth number. Have them continue until they have a column of 10 numbers. They can use a calculator. You remember the seventh number. Multiply it by 11 in your head, simply by adding like so. 78 plus 78, 858. Tell them to add the column, but not push the equal sign. Hold it against your head and give them the answer. 858. <sighs> hey, it figures. Some people believe that plants respond when you talk to them. Well, here's a plant that responds when you touch it. Watch. Now that's a sensitive plant. In fact, that's what it's called, the sensitive plant. The technical name is Mimosa pudica, but sensitive plant is a lot easier to remember. This touchy little friend will fold up when you brush it with your finger. It folds up in the rain or when you water it. And it will even close when the wind blows very hard. It also folds up at night. In normal sunshine, a healthy plant comes fully back open in about 15 minutes. What causes all this sensitivity? It's a process called thigmotropism by scientists. The sensitive plant is native to semi-tropical climates, but they're easy to grow just about anywhere during the summer. Greenhouses in many areas sell them already started in pots like these. And you can usually find starter kits of seeds like these in hardware and garden supply stores in the spring. So grow yourself a really sensitive friend, the sensitive plant. What do you call a vampire who's been hit by a steamroller? Count Spatula! Ha, 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 ha